So you might be in a situation where for some reason iOS 18.6.2 is just not installing. Now, this can happen for a couple of different reasons. Number one, the very, very first thing I'd recommend doing is to just make sure that your particular update is basically being, you know, downloaded. So sometimes you might have to go through and make your way over to your settings application. Scroll down until you find the general option here, click on software update, and then go through and just kind of refresh the page and make sure you're connected to a good internet or Wi-Fi connection. Sometimes if you're not connected to a good Wi-Fi connection or a you know, data connection, that could be one of the issues you might end up having here. Now, another thing you might want to try doing too is make sure you have enough storage saved on your device click on your iPhone storage option here and just make sure that your storage is properly good. Sometimes you might not have enough storage saved on your device and that can also be another problem that you might end up having and that's another very, very big popular issue that a lot of people end up having here. Now, if that's still not working, you might want to make sure that your phone is even supported with iOS 18.6.2. Again, the iPhone 10 or and above are supported with it. If you have an iPhone 10 or below, that's not necessarily going to work either. And if that's still not working, try just going through and restarting your phone. Hold down the volume up in the power button, slide the power off, try powering on and off your phone, and that can end up fixing the problem for you as well. So those are kind of the main ways to do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.